What is up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today we are looking at another MLP horror TikTok AU. This one is called Mind Virus. Now I came across this one a while ago, just didn't really remember it, but it's one I've wanted to talk about. Now here, I clicked on a little playlist thing. There's 11 episodes. We got one. No, we, we got the uh, translated little uh, Mind Virus character information. So it's all the character information. Uh, part one, part two, part three, part four, part five, part six, part seven, part eight, part nine is on the bottom and part ten's right here. So we're just going off of these ten just to see what it's like for a bit. I'm a little out of breath because I just like got done running for a bit and I'm fat. So, oh man, I got to slow my roll. Anyway, let's take a look here. So Twilight, she, she's pretty healthy. She's one of the few who's more or less hygienic. Her health is 68%. She needs to find a cure. It, it, it appears as if Twilight is okay. She looks quite normal. I'm not seeing anything too wrong with her. She has a knife and a syringe in her, oh no, it's a sedative in her inventory. Rarity and Sweetie Belle and Opal, or Opal, I, I don't I don't know. Somebody even comments on one of my videos about how I say it. I'm just gonna call her Opal. She's immune. Oh no, Sweetie Belle is immune. But it doesn't look like Rarity's immune. They got water, and I assume that's food or something, and a flashlight in their inventory. Health is 50%, but it's descending. Thirst is quite high, hunger's quite low. Magic corrodes the horn. Oh, that's not good. Rarity, when are you going to sleep? Stress crying and bites. And uh, the cat looks fine. Opal, yeah, Opal's leading, feeling fine. Applejack is healthy. Although this little coloration is a nice little design thing. She actually looks really cool here. Health is quite high. There's been insomnia since Granny Smith's death and nervousness. Despite the virus, Apple's family can't part with the farm and desperately wrestles it away from the infected. Dirt due to cons constant farm work right here. Where's Twilight? My family, we're strong, we can handle it. Are the apples poisoned? She has an apple and an ax in her inventory. Fluttershy is also healthy. She has sandwiches and I think this is like something that holds drinks, I don't know. Partial amnesia, she doesn't remember losing her hoof. Oh, she had to get it amputated. Where are all my animals? Where's Rainbow Dash? When did all this start? But she overall appears to be in a decent position, although she's quite thirsty and hungry. She is in a bunker created by Twilight. Twilight had her hoof amputated so she wouldn't get infected. Pinkamina Dying Pie has a machete and a walkie-talkie in her inventory. Rainbow Dash is partner in exterminating infected ponies. Keep up. Scars from the blood from the service. Uh, basically, she looks pretty healthy, a little thirsty and a little bit hungry. No matter what, I'm a defender of my friends. I cut off my hair so it wouldn't get in the way of cleaning up infected ponies. Lost her hind hooves in a battle with the infected. Ow. Rainbow Dash has a gun and bullets and a walkie-talkie. Head and creator of a special unit to exterminate infected ponies. She recently lost her eye. Forget about Twilight, she won't help you. The wound from the infected pony, the wound has healed. So is she like, immune? Amputated the wing, replaced it with a prosthetic. Oh, that's cool. Don't bat your eyes, they're everywhere. She cut off her hair so it wouldn't get in the way of cleaning up the infected ponies. Aggressive, paranoid, and violent. Scars and blood from the service. Spike is infected, but he has a low danger level. His disease stage is first, Twilight's test subject. He realizes what's going on, he didn't have time to kill anyone, and he maintains long eye contact. Twilight, I'm hungry. Where's Rarity? I want Rarity. Twilight, my stomach is bursting from the inside out. Why won't you get that thing off my chest? A tumor... It is... Is it about to explode? Yeah, it looks like it's about to fucking explode. Next up. Part 1. Yeah, Spike's in the back in the little chamber there. Friend, are you writing? Oh yeah. Hello, whoever found this entry, I hope you found her in peacetime. Because if not, I hope you're watching from a safe place. I'm Twilight. And this is Spike, my assistant, who has the first stage of the virus. Look at him. 
He seems happy to see you. Haha. <laughs> We're in my bunker. This is the only safe and isolated place. The only thing you need to know about the infected is... Symptoms of infection is bite on the body, slurred speech, uneven walking, headaches, and nausea. At the first stage of infection, the body color changes to paler or, on the contrary, black. The eyes become wider, body parts stretch out, and the victim is still conscious. At the second stage, the body begins to rapidly decompose and stink. The speed of the pony increases sig significantly. The body is stretched even more. The bones cannot stand it, which is why some parts of the body simply hang down. A pony can rush between its con consciousness, either be normal or not. We are diligently searching for a vaccine and a pony. Dot dot dot. Twilight says help. Or not Twilight, but Spike. Twilight, yes. My chest. Ah. Alright. Oh, we got some stuff with Pink Amina and Rainbow. Remind me again, what are we doing here? We're not far from the Evergreen Forest. You got worms in your brain or what? We're scouting for missing ponies right now. You still want to find Zakora? Does that make sense? I haven't heard a peep from her since the incident started. Why can't we just try and find Twilight instead of doing crap? Don't you want to find the rest of our friends? Pinky, don't cross the line. I'm also your commanding officer. We don't need Twilight. If we find Zakora, she'll be capable of giving us what we want. Do you understand me? Yes, ma'am. She'll be found at any cost. She must know something about this. So Zakora's missing. Oh, should I pause it? Uh, a little... Yeah, missing. There's no info on her. Alright. Oh, the fucking, um... Silent Hill music. Fluttershy. I know how much you don't like this, but this only happens to you. You will be under surveillance, but for now, tell me more. Meat. Even though I'm a pony, I don't... I want meat. I eat meat, and I don't understand why I'm suspected of being infected. No, I don't want to eat ponies under any circumstances. I never even had such a thought. I'm not infected. Yes, Angel is missing, but I swear I didn't kill him. Please believe me, I am not a threat. Okay, Fluttershy, you eat me as if nothing had happened. You just want him and no withdrawal symptoms have been noticed. Can you survive without me approximately several months? Yes. Looks like it's a little warped there. That's interesting. Somebody said, please don't let her be infected. I love her. I love her too. She's amazing. All right, we got more. I couldn't save him. I'm assuming she's talking about Spike from the next slide from what it said, because I was able to read that quite quick. Quite quick, quick, quick. I can never talk properly because I'm fucking stupid. Spike has entered the second stage. How could I let this happen? Now, I can't even turn to Fluttershy for support because I think she's infected. Is this not, or no, is this what good friends do? I'm trying not to go crazy just like Fluttershy, but we are not together now, which means we will definitely go crazy. No, this can't go on any longer, of course. It's dangerous to go out, but we need to find at least someone. This bunker is much safer. There is too much space. Applejack, Rarity, Pinkie Pie, Rainbow Dash, I will find you. And I am sure that I will find you not infected. Fluttershy, I'll go with her. So, basically, Twilight's going to team up with Fluttershy and trying to find the others. Okay. Uh-oh. There's gore and blood in this one. Somebody said, I really love how you did Zakora. So, Zakora is infected. i seen this little meme video that popped up about this uploaded by the same person. I'll show you guys in a minute. It's really funny. But anyway... We're deep into these woods, so don't you dare lag behind, you understand? This forest has been feared since the outbreak of this epidemic, and our first priority is to understand the source of the horror and check out Zakora's hut. Yeah, I'll keep up. Hopefully we won't be here too long, though, and that we won't leave empty-handed. It's so suspiciously quiet in these woods, it's starting to annoy me a little. I didn't think Zakora's hut would be so deep in the forest. But my calculations were on the right track. There shouldn't be a problem except for the infected. They say this forest is where it came from. So that's it. 
So you want to go to the Sakura's hut even though she's missing and ask her directly what the hell is going on? Is that what I'm getting at? Doesn't that seem like a crazy idea? I didn't authorize you to talk much. Shut your mouth and better focus on the road. Oh, I think we're here, great. But let's just hide and watch for now. Damn, okay, are you sure you got this under control? I am very confident in my actions and intentions. Whatever. There's Zakora, I told you. My gut tells me something's not right. God damn! God damn! Holy shit! That's not creepy at all! God damn! Fluttershy, I want to apologize. I'm sorry I suspected you. The infected cannot fly. The infected cannot fly? I didn't know about that. And anyway, what bothers me is that you don't tell me about most of your research. I heard Spike screaming. Please don't tell me. Oh God. Sweetie, don't talk at all. Do not attract attention in any way. If you hear rustling or clattering hooves, immediately hide under the bed. Then she walks out. Fluttershy, have you thought about flying up and looking down on the territory? We've been walking for about an hour and everyone we saw were simple infected. Dashy would do it much faster than me. I'm not sure. You'll literally be left on your own. You'll literally be left on your own. There are a lot of infected ponies around. I'll fly up slowly. Even though I suspected you of an infection, are you worried about me? Of course. Girls? Oh man, we got Rarity. So Rarity's back now. Please tell me that you are not my dying hallucinations from lack of sleep. Holy shit, Rarity. And she says Rarity. Please tell me that a safe place exists. Unintelligible sounds of slow clatter and hooves. I think she went under the bed or something. Sweetie Belle, yeah, I just, <laughs> I didn't even look at it. Sweetie Belle hit under the bed. Oh, DJ Ponthry is fucking disgusting. She looks vile. Oh my god. That is gross. What happened to her mouth? That must be like the little thing that was on Spike's chest. I'm assuming she's gonna eat the cat. It's. Yes, Rarity, a safe place exists. Tell me more, please. Are you alone? Sweetie Belle and Opal. I left them too long. Uh oh. Uh oh. Rarity, they're all right. Yeah, and then she's eating the fucking cat. <laughs> of course. She's eating my cat. This bitch is eating my cat. Stupid fucking merge. I'll kill you. No, Rarity, stop. It will not come back. Forget it. Your horn will soon stop working. Take care of it. This is not the zombie that can get a tumor. He has mushrooms on his body. If you explode the tumor, the spores will fly all over the room. But when he's busy eating, he literally doesn't notice anyone around him. And before he finishes, oh pal, sweet Belle, did you hear me? Come out. She came out of the bed and just looks like she dashed. So we got to go down here because this one comes before it. Because this is episode 9. I like this one because, like I said, whenever I come across these videos, I like them and then immediately scroll to look for more. That way I don't, like, spoil it at all. So I did not look at this, but I liked it. So here we go. On to part 9. We're almost done here. Hard breath. Rarity, you should know Opal could no longer be saved. She ate her alive and infected with her spores a little more. And sweetie, sweetie Belle wouldn't have died. She has immunity. Go take a swim. We have all the means to take care of ourselves, Rarity. I can't see you so dirty and desperate. Thank you very much, Twilight. Is there a bathtub here? We'll take a bath now. See you later. I killed Spike. It could no longer be returned. It became uncontrollable. I tried to tell him something, but he didn't hear. This means he won't help me anymore. But his sacrifice was not in vain. Spike, I promise I will find a vaccine. Especially now with Sweetie Belle. But I promise I won't harm this little angel. But okay. I want to tell you about the types of infected. I didn't finish my last post. Ahem. At the third stage, mutations may appear. 
but mostly it's just aggressive behavior and incredible strength. Pieces of skin may hang down exposing bones. They are easier to kill if you shoot the tumor. Spike had it, and I didn't touch it because it would have led to his death, but the tumor exploded on its own. That pony that I saw in the room with Rarity, in general, there are types of infected that succumb to another virus. We haven't come up with a name for it yet, but that doesn't matter. The most important thing is that these are mushrooms. Mushrooms like the mind virus came from the Everfree Forest, and the worst thing about them is their spores. Without a gas mask, the mushrooms will penetrate the lungs and sprout from inside, living or dead pony. And Opal's fate is terrible. After all, she was eaten alive and, uh, the main thing is that everything is fine with Sweetie Belle. If God forbid you see a pony with mushrooms on its body, run. After death, they release spores. By the way, she ate Opal. I was in a state of adrenaline and didn't have time to see her completely, but there was a tumor in the area of her mouth, and she ate her with it? This is the first time I have seen this, but from now on I will be insured. The tumor attached itself to the cat and sucked blood. My notes are running out, and soon there is progress in creating a vaccine. I will definitely contact you. On to part 10. So this is the final part we have so far. Oh, dude, that fucking Zakora is terrifying. Jesus Christ. I told you. Shh, just sit tight. Just because she's in the final stages of infection doesn't mean she can't see us or hear us. Even though her hearing and eyes aren't as strong, it's best to be quiet. What do we do then? We could sit here forever. I feel a chill run down my spine. I can feel her eyes on us. A gun. I have a gun. I know what we're gonna do. Wow, you got any ideas? Go ahead. Tell me your plan. Our target is the tumor, Pinky. If she stands still, I can hit the spot and then the tumor will explode and Zakora will drop dead, especially since she's already falling apart. When did she get here? Dash, she's here. Shut up, Pinky. I know what I'm doing. Heavy breathing. It was... It was really scary. I've never seen an ugly like that before. Anyway, the way is clear. We can move on and see Zakora's house. There's some dots. She was so fucking ugly. Uh-huh. One shot at the target and it just exploded. It's gross every time. Let's get back to the house. She could have left notes on her condition. Well, or we'll find out where it all started. So basically, that's all we got so far from this little thing here. Because I clicked on this, the mind virus, the playlist. Now, I was going to show y'all that meme because I thought it was really funny. Let me see if I can find it. No. By the way, if you look here, the story is also like in Russian here. And English as well. I, I believe it's Russian. I'm not too certain though. I'm looking for it. What the fuck? I don't know. I'm looking for this meme because I know she uploaded it. I literally just saw it. Yeah, let me go to my liked videos. Let's see here. Because I know I saw it. Right here. Baby girl. Daddy's home. Yeah. <laughs> Such a, a dear God. But that's basically the meme that I saw, which led me to the account. And I looked for the English uh, translation of the story here, which came to this playlist. Once again, I will copy that in case anyone wants to go read it for themselves. Basically, this is a pretty cool story. Um, that design for Zakora is pretty terrifying, but it's cool as shit. It's so flipping cool. But anyway, I hope you all enjoyed. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe if you did. Dislike if you didn't. It's completely fine. Either way, I really don't mind. And that's all I got to say. So thanks for watching, and I will see you all in the next video. Peace. Fuck this in life, I'm just too late I got two eyes in the back of my head I'm watching everything you're doing instead of Being here with me Being here with me I gotta sit you twice, but you know I ain't scared of it I can give a fuck about it